I started a new Android Studio project. That is what SQLite database demo app. So here uh, I'll go with you know like uh, I'm going to store the applications here. Indeed, right? I can't do that to Thursday. I'll copy this. Now into paste here, right? So next button. So API will then that's the next button. Empty activity and what here, guys? Main activity like that. See, guys. I'm going to create one a simple. I want to take a simple project like this. So we'll take one student form. So what is the student form? Student number. Student Student name, student address, student mobile number. So you have to insert the student record in your database. You have to update the student record. You have to retrieve the student record. You have to delete the student record. We have to perform the all the operations by using we can take one form. Okay, guys. Uh, let me know. Explain. You. Okay. Can you see here, ma'am? And first, I go with uh, linear layout. It is what uh, it is. What transparent. This one, match parent, orientation is what vertical. Okay. Uh, so here, uh, what I'm going, what I'm going to do is, uh, see here, I selected the event like this. See here, ma'am. I'm going to take uh, five buttons. The first one is insert the student record, and second one is. Update the student record, and third one is delete the student record, and fourth one is retrieve the student record by student number, and fifth one is retrieve all the student records in the list. Okay, clear, guys? We are going to perform all the operations over here. Understand, guys? Hello. Yes, sir. Understand. Okay. See here, guys. I'm going to create the buttons over here. First, I create what mark? ID. At that press ID. TV insert. Okay. Height is what? Wrap content. Next, width is what? Match parent. Margin is what? Twenty-five dp. Padding is what? Twelve dp. And text is what mark? Insert. Student record. Insert student record. Uh, background is what Ash zero zero eight D D eight eight. Okay. And what gravity is what ma? Center. Text color is what black color. Text style is what bold. Text size is what twenty two SP. Okay. Fine. Likewise. 
Now we have we'll create one more button called what more? Key update. TV update. Okay. It is what? Update student record. Update student record. Okay, I'll go with this, you know, like uh, 15 dp. Okay, so and next one is what mark? Delete the student record. Let's see. It is what TV delete. Delete student record. So you can convert this one to what mark? 15 dp. Okay. Next. Last one is what? Retrieve, right? That is what? TV retrieve. Retrieve. Retrieve student record. The last one is what mark? View all records. TV view. Random of view. View students records. New student because clear guys. So the five buttons we are going to create at all here. See. Fine. Go with this margin. Okay, see here. We have to create what? Functionality, right? That is what, ma? Text view, right? Hmm. TV insert. Next TV update. Next TV delete. Next TV retrieve. And next TV view. So, five buttons, right? We have to initialize this, right? See how to initialize tv insert equal to find v by id r dot id dot tv insert or enter cast to text view update delete retrieve view tv v1 it is what tv retrieve it is what tv delete it is our TV update. Okay, here TV update, TV delete, TV retrieve, TV view. Okay, and finally, what we got up on click site right? TV insert dot. Set on click is now of what? This. It is what TV? Update. TV. Delete. TV. Retrieve. TV. Okay. So we have to write what? All tender makes my activity works for the on click method. Let us check V dot get ID. Okay, if case or dot id dot tv insert that perform some action. If tv insert is what update, right? It is what delete, it is what retrieve, it is what view. Okay, fine. If I click on the intent here, see my I'll call the method like this intent. Intent i is i g equal to new intent of uh, where you are ma when where ma main activity dot this where you have to go yeah. insert activity dot class and what start activity of what more i likewise it is what tv 
अपडेट एक्टिविटी अपडेट एक्टिविटी एंड इज डिलीट एक्टिविटी एंड दिस इज रिट्रीव एक्टिविटी एंड दिस इज वॉट लास्ट वन इज वॉट मोर उट Insert layout. Clear the layout is as well. Okay. Next, update activity. Extends activity on create set content view or dot or dot layout dot. Update layout. Create resource files. Next is what. Layout is what now? Delete layout. Layout layout is one second, guys. The last one is what now? Retrieve right. Extends what? Activity on here. Set content view. Or dot layout dot. Retrieve layout. Like each and every one can get get the things or not. Anyone having a doubt? Please raise your hand. Raise your things. I will get back to you. Okay. If anyone having a doubt. We do here, ma. We have to write what uh, go for the manifest file and add all the activities here. It is what insert activity. Next, update activity. Next, delete activity. Next, retrieve activity. Next, new student activity. Okay. So in the meanwhile, you have to open your Jenny motion. Up to any queries, guys? I think so. A common for the things over there, right? Uh, see guys, when we click on the main, the go for main activity, when you click on the insert button, you have to navigate to what page? Insert activity page. So in the insert activity page, okay, we have an insert layout or not? You need to create this layout, right? See how? See guys, I'll take edit text over here. Edit text. ID. ID. Under press ID. ID. S number, the student number. Height is what? Wrap content. Width is what? 
match parent margin left 25 dp margin top 25 dp margin right 25 dp after what mark hint enter student number enter student number input type is what mark number type okay so after the same thing for what you can go with this et student name enter student name it is what text person name and the next one is what enter student address enter student address it is what more text postal address next what mobile number right it student phone enter student mobile number it is what phone okay i need to create how many buttons two buttons in a linear layout right horizontal okay height is what wrap content width is what match parent orientation is what more horizontal okay so here what margin left is what 25 dp margin right is what 25 dp margin top as what 25 dp you need to create what how many buttons mark two buttons right see id at the rate id tv insert height is what wrap content width is what 0 dp weight is what more 0.5 next text is what insert okay gravity is what center background is what pass 00 dd 88 and we are going padding is what more 10 dp okay and same thing for the other play what more TV cancel okay and this part cancel we need a space in between these two right see you can take what more view type a height is what 1 dp width is what 0 dp width is what 0 0.01 like this so we, we need what a space in between these two also so we increase the text size also more text size is 20 dsp text color is android color black and text style is what bold you can apply this one to here also we want to know like you're showing you okay fine See, first we have to insert the records, then we can go for the things over there, right? Uh, so, coming to the functional department, what do you hear? Edit text, et, s number, et, s name, et, s address, et, s, form. Okay, and we have what? Text view, right? TV insert TV cancel. We have to initialize this right. TV S number equal to find me by ID or dot ID dot ET S number. S name. S address 
is from is from this address is name is number find your tv insert is equal to find me by id or dot id dot et sorry tv insert it is what one tv cancel Sorry, no. TV cancel. You are apply what on click right for this next for TV cancel like this. I will switch V dot get ID so case or dot ID dot TV. Insert break this case or dot id dot tv cancel break this click on the cancel what happened ets number dot get text dot clear et s name dot get text dot clear et s address dot get text dot clear et S phone dot get text dot clear. Next one share right A string S number equal to ETS number dot get text dot to string. Next string S name equal to ET S name dot get text dot to string. Next string s yes. address equal to ed s address dot get text dot to string next string s yes. phone equal to ed s yes. phone dot get text dot to string okay understand guys any doubts up to now no sir no okay so next what we do is uh, whatever the value you entered from the uh, insert button i'm going to save this values to my database right so in android we need to create a one database class c so i'm going to create one new package here the package name is database okay i'm in this one i'm going to create a new class called db helper what is that database helper class simo is in a, especially in android so when you are going to working with sqlite database mainly we are going to work with two classes one is sqlite open helper class and second one is sqlite database class one is sqlite open helper class and second one is sqlite database class see what is sqlite open helper class and what is the purpose see sqlite open helper is a class to communicate with your activity and what database so in sqlite open helper class mainly we have uh, two methods and we have one constructor so like this extends what the class for sqlite open helper class second one we have a methods right and unimplemented methods we have to implement what two methods what and what on create and what on upgrade there are two methods you are going to import and we need to create one constructor create constructor right we have to create one constructor also okay now what is the purpose of constructor the purpose of constructor is what to create the object for that so once you create the object for the existing class by using of this class object we are going to call all the methods okay see ma so see 
here we have like this so db helper context and here what context mark here what name what is the name mark database name mark so i am writing a database name called student db so mark see factory mark so by default we can pass the factory as null so what is factory and the entire we'll discuss later but in the, in up to now we can we will concentrate on what when we we'll see as a factory we can pass what more null you are going to pass and what is the version we can pass the version 1 tomorrow it may be one version 2 or 3 like that okay like this you need to create one constructor and what is we in what if what we are going to implement in on create method schema if we are going to create any table for your database the table creation logic we can write in on inside the or create method okay schema so what is sql database sql database is a class to perform the sql operations like insertion create update delete okay so all the operations right so when you are going to operate the sql uh, sql operations like insertion update and deletion the entire operations will be using by using a class called what sql database class see guys in sql database class we have one method called execute sql execute sql execute sql is a method to execute your sql commands okay fine see guys uh, what is the command for creating the table guys in uh, sql insert into no 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 creating create a table. table create table yeah. create table table name create table table name and what uh, column name data column name data data type see. and all the over notes yeah. yeah that's right see like this create table table name what is the table name student student okay and okay the first column is what mark student number it is what integer data is what mark integer i am applying the primary key for that applying what mark primary key so what is the what is the purpose of primary key mark duplicates not allowed duplicates will not be allowed for that okay and next is what more s name so there is no uh, for uh, for text for string there is a data type called text mark in sql we have a data type called what text text what student address we have a data type called what text and next is what uh, student address and what the last one is what student form right and it is what uh, student uh, address and it is what student name and it is what student number student number student name student address student phone so there is again it is what text okay how many things now 1 2 3 4 only four up there yeah, are only four okay so like this you are going to create the table in sql schema okay understand guys create table table name okay you are going to pass what table column name data type next uh, it is what here uh, column name data type sir database we are sql database sql sir sql sql database Yeah, see, we have a separate database called what SQL database. There we can see the things over there. Okay, like this, you are going to create your table, Amma. Create table, table name, student number, student name, student address, and what form. Okay, so this is what what? This is the logic for what? Creation of the logic. Okay, and the entire logic you can write in where, Amma? On create method only. And what about on upgrade? See, on upgrade is a method to modify. You need um, to modify your table, like you know, like if you are going to change your uh, table name, or if you are going to change your column name, or you are going to delete the column name. So if you are going to do any modifications on your table, on that time you are going to write the entire modification logic on your table. You can write in there now on upgrade method. 
okay that's what so right now i don't want to do anything stuff for that i i don't want to do anything uh, um do modification on that so that's why i'm going to put mp as over on upgrade method as of now okay understand now clear any doubts yes sir it's clear i need everyone to yes sir clear sir i need everyone response at least two chart uh, because of you know in our class we have seven members uh, six members are there but i need only two member response and what about rest of four yes sir clear okay next so we need to insert right sima for insertion for insertion the records we have a i will take a method like this like this public in that call what long okay uh, i will take a method like this insert student insert insert student record records i'll take my own method amma okay in this method i'm going to pass in the parameters like this string yes number string yes name string yes address yes name yes number as yes, yes address and what string s yes, phone okay next so insertion is a what operation ma write operation or read operation write operation write operation right so one more thing ma in a, in the update method we have a parameter called what escalate database on update method we have parameter called what escalate database but insert should record doesn't have what parameter called what escalate database so what i'm going to do is i declare globally ma like this escalate database db i initialize this db equal like this db equal to this dot get writable database okay if you are going to read the data you can write what this dot get readable database okay fine if you are going to insert your record in your database dynamically on the time in our android we have a class called content values like this what is more content values cv equal to new content values like this in content values class we have a object called put we have a method called what put comma key comma value like this okay same thing four items i am going to pass uh, what is the value mom so the parameter name what is the parameter name s number here what s name here what s address here what s phone so these are all the key values but what the values but what about key in in android sql database okay while you working with the insertion the records on the time whatever the key uh, you don't want to pass key as your wish we are going to pass the key as your table column name as a key the table column name as a key you are going to pass like this and sure guys sir one query is here yeah so on by, by using this column name i am going to store my data in this column the the value will be stored in this column the value this value will be stored like this so in the place of key we are going to pass your table column names the value is what whatever the value will you will you will get from the edit text that that is this are, these are the values i will call this method in my activity how i am going to call see one second please wait i will call this method in my activity how I see the until later. Okay, and finally, what more? In SQL database class, we have a method called what insert method. 
in this method we are going to pass what table name null null column hat value and what content values object okay what is the table name ma student student table you can pass here student table i initialize into id wrong id equal to i return this id over here okay if see ma when you are going to insert your record in your database the database will give you one id so if you get the id as positive value so, so we can confirm that your record will successfully inserted if the if the id will come minus 1 okay your record will not be inserted like that we have to confirm okay see ma so i am going to call this method in where here right so once i once i call this this class method to here means i am going to create the object of this class see how db helper db helper equal to null i initialize this one here now to initialize db helper equal to this is initialization mark new db helper of connect get application context so once you initialize this we can call the method here db helper dot what is the method mark insert student records ah uh, what is this s number next yes name ah uh, next yes address next s phone number one second you will you find it in this okay guys and i will get what id what is id ma long id equal to I'll get like this. If id not equal to minus one, then what happen? We'll confirm that your record will be successfully inserted, right? See, I'll go like this. Intent id equal to new intent of get application context. Okay. Next what? I'll go for what? Main activity dot class and Start at query of what mark i. Suppose if not means what? If you get the minus one id, what happen? You put toast toast dot make text get application context. Ah, uh, what is that? Uh, record not inserted. Record not inserted. Toast dot then shop dot. Okay. So can I run the application and see the output for this? Okay, now see here when I am going to click on the insert. 
student record what happen you will get this form or not see if i click on the student number as 1001 student name as money student address as hyderabad student mobile number as 9959297904 if i click on the insert button what happen you have to navigate to main activity once you get this page we can you can confirm that your record will be inserted successfully right see like this what what happen you navigate to main page right so you confirm that your your uh, data will be saved clear or any doubts Okay. Hello. Any query, no, guys? Sir. No, sir. No. Okay. So you you need to confirm, right? So whether uh, whether the, this record is uh, really saved in your database or not, right? So further, what I'm going to do is when I'm going to click on the retrieve button. I entered a user number as one zero zero one. When I click on the data, what happen? Your data will be displayed on your text view. How we can? So we can we we see that one. Okay. Simo. Uh, first, you have to go for what main activity? What is it? Retrieve, right? Retrieve. Is a retrieve activity. Okay, so go to uh, retrieve XML. It is what my here. I'll take what edit text for what. Already we have right. Student number. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Already we have in the reserve. I mean, uh, in the just we can uh, copy and uh, we have to change this asset. Oh, I mean, sir. Hmm. Copy this. Paste here. Okay, we can change this one as what ma? Sorry, this is edit text only. This is edit text only. So except this, we can change this one as what? Text, text, text to view. Text to view. Okay, it is what ma? TV yes name, and we don't need hint ma. In the place of in what to do, so we don't need input type also. It is what text. Yes, name. I mean, can play what ma? Padding. Padding is what? Shortened DP. Okay. And same thing for what ma? Is also. It is what text view. It is what TV. And we don't need hint, and we don't need you know like. Uh, Input type is what adding shell DP and what text is what ma? S address. Okay, and the same thing here what you know it is what text view. It is what TV is phone. Okay, we don't need uh, this two. In the place of here, what padding, short DP, text is what ma? Phone. Okay. This is what we have. So we can change this one into what uh, we can apply what padding, short DP. Okay, no ma? See, uh, I'll go the retrieve activity here. What do you hear ma? We can take what? Uh, so sorry, sorry. Uh, we have to change this one into what? TV. Retrieve. TV. Retrieve. Text. All caps. True. And what you cancel. Okay. See here. I uh, I'll go for the function part. Uh, it is what ma? Edit text right. Et. S number. Okay. Next is what? Text view, right? 
Next is what? So you have to initialize this, right? ET test number equal to find V by ID dot dot ID dot ET S number. Next is what? TV S address equal to find V by ID. That is what? R dot ID dot TV S address. So one two so that is what now yes name yes phone cancel retrieve first check out whether it is correct or not. See uh, after that what now? We have to take what? On click right. TV retrieve dot set on click listener of what? This next TV cancel dot set on click listener of what? This okay. We need to go with make set activity and what on click method. So you have to go with what switch V dot get ID. Okay, case or uh, dot id dot it is what uh, you know uh, tv retrieve. Okay, break this tv cancel right cancel et s number dot get text dot clear. Next, what here is what string right string s number right equal to ETS number dot get text dot two string okay see now I, I will I call a method like this get data from database I'm going to create a method like this in this method I'm going to pass what S number based on S number I'm going to get all the values right see I create a method here now like this okay see when you are going to get the data from database okay See, uh, we are in our Android. We are going to use a class called cursor class. What class, ma? Cursor class. And one more thing, ma. So, uh, which of uh, I mean, uh, retrieve operation is for read or write? Read operation, right? Read. Read, read operation. So, what I'm going to do is see. First, I'm going to create the db helper class object here, like db helper. Db helper equal to null. And I create what? SQLite database also. SQLite database db equal to null. So I'm going to initialize this db helper db helper equal to new db helper of web application context. So what I'm going to do here, see in this method, what I'm going to do here is db equal to db helper dot get readable database. Okay, initialize into database. So in uh, we have a class called what no? cursor class cursor cursor equal to db dot we have a method called what raw query what is that no raw query ah uh, see mom 
on which basis you are going to get things by student number right so we have a command like this select star from student select star from student where where what is the table name column name yes, here ma'am yes student ma student yes, number, yes, number right so copy the student number okay student number select star from student where student number equal to close and what we your student number plus n with single quotes and the cursor factor by default what null okay and another condition here if cursor dot move to first if cursor dot move to first inside this i let the condition do while while cursor dot move to next i'm going to get all the things over here see ma'am how i'm going to get like this i'm going to get a name address phone number right these three things how i'm going to get see cursor dot get string of cursor dot get column index of you can pass a column name here likewise these two things so what is the column column number ma s name right yes name here what string yes name equal to uh, next what yes address address phone phone we have to set this is a little bit tv s name dot set text of s name next tv s address dot set text of s address tv s phone dot set text of s phone finally the data is set over there so i can run the application see the output demo See here, ma. So retrieve when you click on the retrieve button, what happens? It will ask me what, ma. Student number, right? What is the student number? One zero zero one. When I click on the retrieve button, what happens? Your data will be fetched over here, right? See, money, Hyderabad, double line like this. If I entered new record, like one zero zero two, the enter name is. Student name is Sachin. Student address is Azim Mumbai. Sir, please try it with same ID, sir. Ah, that's what. Yeah, let me let me explain. So, your yeah, number is something something I give a number. You will go the uh, same number. If you click on the insert button, what happen? Record not inserted. Okay. If you go to insert this, record inserted. Try to check out that. Simple one zero zero two retrieve same search in Mumbai the number will be displayed over there. Clear guys? Sir, how can we see the database? Yes. Sorry? How can we see the database? Yeah, yeah. See one good question. See, uh, okay. I'll do things. One second. One more. One second, please. If you are going to see your database, okay. Here we have a. Device in the tools we have a device monitor. What is that? Device Android device monitor. So if you are going to open your device Android monitor, what to do is so you are going to open your Android Studio by using a run as 
administrator what you have to open your uh, android studio as run as administrator see like this just right click on this run as administrator one second go ahead Okay, mom. So see, first what we do is we have to download the SQLite browser. What is that? SQLite browser you need to download. So why why we need to download this one means if you are going to see your database records, okay, under that we need what for SQLite browser, right? Just click on this one. So you have to download this one. See, download uh, Windows 64 bit, right? I will download this. Save the file. It will take some time, huh? Okay, no problem. What is that? SQLite browser. Clear, guys? You have to download that first. Clear, sir. Clear. Okay. Yeah. Here, you people find you know like uh, one second. See here, you people find you know like uh, Android to go for the tools. Oh, okay, okay, it's loading. Ah, huh? okay, fine. No problem. Uh, one small announcement, you know, like uh, I'm uh, creating a my Facebook page, like Android Trainings for You dot com. So please like my page, guys. In Facebook. Okay, okay sir. Okay, sir. Send us the link, sir. Excuse me, sir. Yeah. Sir, can we connect our application with SQL database also, sir? Yeah, 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 we can. Okay, could you please give the example to uh, for the connection string, sir? Uh, see, by using that, by using concept proper, by using the uh, services. Web services, sir. Yeah, web services. Okay. Is there any example, sir, for web service? Because I yeah. get. the same question i will i will i will tell you see one thing i will tell you the web services concept in uh, web in json parsing there we can work on uh, uh, server database so and then i will give you things for the okay okay sir and now sir here one thing uh, you have wrote here do and while it is necessary yeah. because we we page only one record at a time no yeah that is what so that is your wish the logic is your wish we get that from your own logic okay 
so in my case i do this logic but in your case you can perform your own logic no problem okay See here, ma. Go for the tools. Android, Android device monitor. Just click on this. You will open your uh, Android device monitor here. You will get the one window of this. Yeah, it's almost downloaded. So just click on this. You need to install this one, right? See. So click next. I agree. Next install. Okay, see, ma, this is your Android device monitor. Okay, see, you people found your application like com dot. So, Jenny motion, right? See, ma, just click on this, select this. You people have to find out your uh, one. See, you have to select File Explorer. In the Explorer, we have find the data. Again, you will find data here. In this data, you find your application name, ma. Like you know, uh, your application name will be like this. Yeah, here, right? Just click on this. You have what database, right? Just click on the click on this. You find what student database, right? You have to pull this uh, this file to desktop, like. SQLite database db dot SQL. Excuse me, what more dot SQL? Save this file in your desktop. Okay. So my here finally what click on what finish button. Once you once you get this finish, okay. You you will get like you will get the SQLite button like this. Okay. Here we have option called what open right open database. Okay. So go for the desktop. What is your file name, ma? Select all files. What is your file name here? SQLite, right? Just click on this, open this. You will find browse data, right? Is coming or not? Guys, are you are you seeing your screen? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Um, okay. Yeah, this is the way we are going to work on this. Okay. Also, give one example uh, with uh, external database. Sir. External database. Yeah, that is what I I will send the two links to you. I will send the links for the examples. So then we can go through that. So if you people doesn't understand that links, so I'll explain later. On, okay, it's very easy. No issue. Okay, sir. Sorry. Link is not working. No, no, no. No, no, no. See one thing. I send. I will. I will send. Not I send. I will send the link. Okay. Sir, he he is asking about that link which is sent in chat room, sir. Which link? Oh, my, my site, ah. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, no, no. Uh, not not like that. See, you know, like uh, just you can go with this. Android trainings. It's under construction, sir. Yeah, Android trainings for you. It's a web, it's a page of Facebook page. It is. It is a Facebook page. Just like me, a Facebook page. Okay. 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 Clear this. A clear this. So, uh, can you continue or can you stop here? Our only two parts is pending: delete and view. Yeah, continue, yeah, sir. Continue. 
Yeah, we can we can continue. Yeah, we can continue. Yeah, fine. Thank you. See. Next is what this. We have to go for what? Delete, right? See. You have to go for what? Update first. Update, right? See now. Same thing. Uh, uh, go for the upgrade XML. So, what are the XML we have in session is there, right? The same I have to copy here. I have to paste here. Okay. Okay, see here in the place of TV update, right? Update. It is what part? Update. Text all caps true. Okay, but what I'm going to do here is these three things I'm going to delete here. I'm going to paste in the outside of here. First, you enter the you enter the number. If you click on the update, then only I'll display on here. If you no 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 one second. This is correct, correct, correct. One second. So inside this you need to create one text schema. Create one text view that is what show TV show height is what more wrap content width is what match parent margin left is what 25 is what 25 Padding is what should and text is what show. Okay, and the gravity is what no center. Okay, center and what you know, background is and text style is what bold, text color is what black, text size is what the previous. Here is see if I entered one number, click on the show button, so you have a display over here. You are going to change your names. You have to click on update. Your values will be updated. Okay. See how. Edit text, right? Edit text. ET. S number. ET. S name. ET. S address. ET. S phone. Finally, what text view right? Text view TV show TV update TV cancel. Okay, we have to check out that ET S number equal to find me by ID or dot edit dot ET S number like this. 
this name this address is phone this phone address name what TV cancel equal to final by the order the return cancel and this what you know like uh, TV show TV update TV update TV show we need to apply what on click right Cancel TV update. So we do click on this. Or switch case we don't get ID equal to case or dot ID dot TV update. Break this next case or dot ID dot TV show break this case or dot edit dot tv cancel break this see if you click on the show button right first what i do here string yes number equal to it is what it is number dot get text dot two string so already we have we have we didn't write like, the logic right what is the logic ma the same logic you are going to perform here. The same thing, right? So copy here. What is the matter, ma? Get data from database. Yes, number. We need to create this. It is what? ET. Yes, name. It is what? ET. Yes, address. It is what? ET. Yes, phone. Right? So, we need to create the database helper class of this like that. Sima. DB helper db helper equal to null next sqlite database db equal to null db helper equal to new db helper of data application context next what same thing db helper db helper equal to same same logic right same logic you have to perform over there okay Fine. See, I'll run the application, see the output first. The first two part is completed and we can go for the things over there. No issue. Yeah, 
that we need the student or the So, I click on the update student record. Okay, it's asking you what must student number, right? I enter the student number as 1001. Okay, so if I click on the show button, what happened? So, money, either birth, the intention will happen. I change money as money kanta. And the number I change the Hyderabad as Hyderabad as when I entered like this, what happened? So when I click on the update, what happened? Ma? So I entered money counter. So automatically the data will be updated or not. So you need to write this logic for update, right? See how. See, first what you do is you have to go for database class. First you have to check out from the internet. How to update a particular record in SQLite database in Android? Okay, so we'll get the links out there, right? See, first thing you are going to check out that. Okay, in this link, we have a solution. This is what solution is a solution amount. Okay, see here this. First, what I'm going to do here is see. I will take a method like this public long update student record. Uh, based on what now you are going to update your record based on what? Student number, right? Again, see. String student number string yes name string yes address string s phone okay uh, this is what ma your perform one operation update is also what get writable database same content values cv equal to new content values cv dot put string key comma value we are going to update only three values right that is what yeah. s name s address s phone so copy this s phone paste here s address paste here Yes, no. yes, no. And finally, what ma? So DB top update of. So here what you're asking me what ma table name? What's your table name ma? Student, right? Uh, what is the content values object? CV, right? Next, we are going to pass what? Where class. So here we have conditions here or not? Where class condition. We are going to pass this one. Based on. So based on what ma? Student number, right? Student number. Based on student number. 
So go to the S number, right? So this is a table name, column name, right? So you are going to copy this column name and you are going to paste here. Based on this condition, I'm going to update my record. Okay. So finally, I install into where, mom? Long ID equal to what written ID. Clear, guys? I'm going to call this method in where? My update activity. Where is your update activity? Yeah, whether here or not? See, very simple mom. String, string, s number equal to et s number dot get text dot to string next string s name equal to et s name dot get text dot to string string s address equal to s address dot get text dot to string string S phone equal to question. S number, S name, etc. Like this. And you got one DB dot update of sorry, DB dot DBL per gamma, DBL per dot. What is this? Update student record. Uh, what is my S number, comma. S name comma S address comma S phone you have to password long ID equal to if ID not equal to if ID not equal to minus one then what happen intent intent I equal to new intent of get application context comma what may activity dot class this is what no start activity for right okay else what happen post dot make text get application context update fail Get fail. What post dot then short dot show. Okay, run the application and see the output. Is what you know, like uh, it's what update, right? See, I entered what one zero zero one. When I click on the show button, right? I entered the name as what Manikanta. I entered the Idra value as what change into Tirupati. If I click on the update button, what happened? You need to what update, right? See more. Yeah, I will update or not? I will check out, right? Retrieve the student record. 1001. Retrieve. What happened? Manikanta Tirupati. Updating or not? Update or not? Yes, sir. Okay. This is about what more? Uh, updated the record things, right? See. Next. How to delete? Next is what how to delete the record, right?
So we'll go for what? Delete activity, right? Delete activity and delete layout. Yeah, we need to write what? Only uh, we can take one edit text based on number, right? Sima ID at the address ID. At the address ID, ET. S number. Height is what? App contains. Width is what? Match parent. Width is what? Enter. S number. Input type as what? Number. Okay. Margin left as what? 25 dp. Margin top as what? 25. 25 dp. Margin right as what? 25 dp. Like this. And we have to create what? One button, right? It is what? Text view. Okay. ID, address plus ID. TV. Delete. Okay. Height is what? Wrap contents. Width is what? Match parent. Uh, text is what? Delete. Okay. And margin left is what? 25 dp. Margin top is what? 25 dp. Margin right is what? 25 dp. And what padding is what? Shell dp. Okay. So gravity is what? Center. Okay. And what, you know, background, right? Dash 00 dt 88 or 77 like this. And text size is 22 sp. And text color is black, black, black color. And what? Text style is what? Bold. Okay. If I click on the enter, right? See. Delete activity, right? See Edit text, right? Edit text. Edit text. ET. S number. Next. Text view. Okay. TV. Uh, delete. Okay. We need to what? Check out, right? ET. S number equal to find me by ID. Or that ID dot ET. S number. Next, TV, delete equal to sign me by ID, order ID dot TV, delete. So, about this TV, delete dot set on click listener off. Of what? This. Alt enter. Next, delete activity device what? On click method. So we have to take what only one 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 method is what see like this string s number equal to ets number dot that text dot string right so you need to write what uh, go for the database activity you have to write with logic right see you have to close the update XML this one you have to close this one also you have to close directory also like this. Simo, I call one more method call what? Public delete record. Okay. So I delete the record based on what now? Student number, right? Long. Okay. See, same thing. DB equal to this dot get uh, writable, right? Get writable database okay so you need to delete right so we need to delete db dot delete mark db dot what delete so here we have a, a where condition like this right see same logic we can take here but we can do what we don't want the right word content values that's it so based on student number you can delete right the same logic you can perform you can delete this one and we need what long id equal to return id okay we call this delete record into where mark delete activity right see uh, you need to create the object or not so this we need to create what Gracias.
dv alpha dot delete record based on student number right i slice clone id equal to yes id not equal to minus one what happened you need to go for what intent i equal to new intent get application context next what what is the class mode main activity dot class and what uh, next is what start back to your phone okay else else what to stop make text the duplication context not deleted to stop then short dot show clear guys only application see the output Simo, so when I click on that delete, when you ask me what ma, it's going to number right one zero zero one. If you don't delete one, what happen? Oh. One second, you get error. You want to go to the error, ma? This is. Null point exception. Why? It's not correct. Oh. One second. Okay. This number one. This one, right? Oh shit. It is cap plus number, right? And then by then run the application. This the calling word one zero zero one. Did automatic data data or not? See ma. If you click on the one zero zero one here, you'll 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 get you'll you didn't get any record over there. Why? Because of here, you don't have any records. Clear, guys? Clear or not? Is clear or not? Uh, sir, yes, sir. So that, uh, yeah. Fine. Uh, uh, so this is about you know like uh, So this is about what you know, like how to create that database and that stuff. So the next is we have one option called View Student Activity, right? So I already I designed a logic for retrieve the activity. What you you people do is select staff from student. You accept this almost the end logic interesting stuff. So we can do by your own. Okay. So if anyone having help, I'll help you out. Okay. Okay, sir. Yeah, I will try. If anyone needs help, I will help, help, help you. Help, help you. No issue. Okay, fine. So this is about what, ma? Working with SQLite database concepts. Okay. So this is about what uh, you know SQLite database concepts. So from this we complete you know like uh, the all the things over here. 
next the next class now one more thing i am going to planning to take the class on sunday you people are uh, okay with that no sir no no sir okay okay fine so we can plan the next monday only no problem okay yes yeah. yeah no problem so take care bye take care good night hello sir yeah, i need your help sir yeah tell me tell me tell me uh, sir can you show that uh, code once more cv let's see which one which one delete or update delete 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 huh? one yes sir yeah database code or uh, database code right yeah yes sir database uh, sir can you uh, uh, explain once more this uh, uh, like see, db dot uh, see uh, in the db dot delete method we have a parameters like three parameters one is table name second one is where class and third one is arguments so by default argument is what null so what is which for where class is what by using student number we are going to get, we are going to delete your record and table name and here we are going to pass the things so all the rest okay okay thank you sir yeah thank you sir yeah i am not able to select the emulator sir it's giving a message sir yeah which one uh, which one you are using geni motion or normal emulator normal sir uh, can you share your system please sure sir sure yeah the rest of the people can leave this thank you bye good night stop your screen after that i can uh, share sir Hello. Yeah, tell me, tell me, share, share your screen, sir, please. Sir, stop your screen. After that, I can see, sir. Okay. Cancel this one. Okay, go for tools, tools, tools. Android, AVD Manager, delete this two, delete this two. Like you know, like put the cursor over here. Delete both. both. both one both one okay sir i'll uh, create virtual device okay so uh, select the nexus 5 select nexus 5 nexus 5 yes, next sir. button next button okay Yeah, click on next. Uh, you can select the second one, mass one, X Z Z H T four. Next button. C C. It yes, asking sir. you, asking you your uh, OS BIOS setup. So you have to disable this one. So just you have to check out from your system. It's it's coming from your problem. Okay, I'll check out. So AVD name, we have to change your AVD name, like sample tester. Okay.
I'll start this. Okay, sir. No, 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 start, start. See, it asking it asking you your bio setup. See, this will happen by through your uh, OS. How can I change that setting, sir? So see, enable VT in your bio security settings. Refer to documentation for your computer. So this this problem will comes from your computer. Just to check out from your hardware. Hardware okay. also. Okay. I don't know exactly about this uh, bio setup and entire stuff. And so check out from I your hardware. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we can try. No I problem. will try with you. Yeah, sure, sure. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Good night. Yeah. Yeah. Good night. Take care. Bye.